Many people are curious about day trading, and this is a simple Forex day trading example just to show you uh, how a particular day trading system would enter and exit a trade during the trading day. So you can see here we're looking at the Euro dollar, US dollar, and this chart is a five minute chart. Down here we have a long entry, we have the market long, and as you can see we go up and the market comes down and moves a bit against us. I know for some of you this may be relatively elementary. Um, you can see even here on a five minute chart the market it, it does move down. Uh, so for all of those people that have uh, are out there searching for a forex trading system with zero drawdown there is no such thing. Um, so you can stop searching for that and look for one that uh, has a reasonable drawdown for your account size and uh, for how you trade and get on with the business of making money and trading Forex. Okay, as you can see, it, now no one likes the market to move against this. It'll, it'll do that. Uh, short time frames can appear to be more erratic, but that's not really what's important. What's important is do you reach your goal? And the goal here, of course, right here, is the profit target in this particular case. Not all day trading systems uh, will have profit targets. Some will simply go on up and they will trade to the end of the day uh, and then they will exit. Many people day trade for a number of different reasons. Um, some people day trade because they don't want to be exposed uh, to any potential huge movements against them overnight, you know, such as if, um, heaven forbid, a war break out or some other type of unrest in another country or our own country or whatever the case might happen to be or natural disasters or uh, any of those types of things that may expose them to additional risks. Uh, other people uh, may day trade uh, because they like the action, the frequency of trading, uh, getting in and getting out and then they may enter and exit several times a day or heck several hundred times a day so it's a matter of preference as far as that goes and day trading is appealing to many people because they feel empowered uh, they feel like they're making their own trading decisions etc etc now there's absolutely nothing wrong with uh, trading on larger time frames uh, day trading has become popular because day trading appeals to the large audience of individuals who happen to have smaller accounts and if this were a larger uh, time frame like say a daily chart then the placement of your stops is going to mean uh, a larger amount of money so whereas you may be able to uh, day trade reasonably uh, with say a ten thousand dollar account I'm throwing that number out there I'm not saying you should start with ten thousand dollars or you shouldn't start I'm just it's an arbitrary number uh, th perhaps uh, uh, because the moves during the day inside of a day trading system and the fact that maybe you have a profit target so the uh, the frequency of wins is uh, a bigger comfort level for you but uh, it is important to realize that the stops can be closer uh, to your entry point and where a stop in this particular case may be uh, 50 pips, maybe $500. A stop uh, in a longer term system uh, it may be 200, 300 pips. Uh, or two to three thousand dollars. So quite naturally, it would be difficult to trade that with a uh, with a smaller account size. Anyway, a quick introduction to day trading. Um, day trading can be done correctly. It can be done profitably, and uh, it has been used and will continue to be used by successful individual traders and institutions the world over.